type 7, example 1. In each of the following questions, one word, which is in capitals, has had three consecutive letters taken out. These three letters are also a real word. Find the appropriate three-letter word. Here's our sentence, and here's the word in capitals. Now, this word in capitals has had three consecutive letters taken out. Consecutive just means one after the other. And the letters that have been taken out are also a real word. So she said Yule before she boarded the plane. The best thing to do is read the sentence, she said Yule before she boarded the plane, and see if we can think of the word that this should be. And then if something obvious pops into your mind, check to see if it's on the answer sheet. And if it is, mark it off and then move on. If nothing obvious does pop into your mind, then it's time to look at the answer sheet and try each one of the three letter words at different positions within the word in capitals and see if it makes a real word. So let's try that first with bit. Let's try bit at various positions within Yule. So let's look at it at the front. Now this makes bite well, which isn't actually a real word. Let's move it along to the second position. Ebitwell, no, nope, also not a real word. Move it along again. Ebitwell, no. Nope. Again, Yulbitwell, mm, I don't think so. Yulbitwell, again, not a real word. And at the end, Yulbit, no, it's not a real word. So, so we know that it can't be bit. Bit can't go anywhere within this capitalized word to make a real word. So let's move on now and try far at various positions in Yul. So, let's try it at the beginning. Ah, farewell. Ah, that's a real word. So let's, let's have a look at this in the sentence and see if it makes sense. She said farewell before she boarded the plane. That looks good to me. So that means that our answer is far. So mark far on your answer sheet, and you're done. Thank you.